Comes out swinging, putting the final touches around TD Ameritrade Park before the balls start flying at the College World Series. And the teams are familiar to Omaha baseball fans. KMTV Action 3 News reporter Josh Egbert shows us the activity near the downtown ballpark. Josh. Yeah, Craig, it is crunch time as they welcome those teams to Omaha. The tents are up, merchandise being brought in, and there's excitement in the air around here, especially since one of Omaha's team favorites is coming home to play here at TD Ameritrade Park. It's the unofficial sign the College World Series is upon us. The names of the eight teams put up inside Baseball Village. 1,540 miles. And there's one team in particular many are happy to see back. I think everyone's really excited about LSU, kind of in a different way this year because they did kind of fizzle out. The, you know, two years ago when they were here, it was not a strong appearance. Having the Tigers back in Omaha, not only exciting for fans, but for vendors as well. If to have an LSU order going in, you know that's probably three times as many t-shirts as they might have ordered for another team. Let's put them right above Fort Worth going east. Jenny Peters with Omaha's Baseball Village says along with the sales, LSU fans seem to just up the atmosphere around TD Ameritrade Park. You want people that are going to bring tons of people into our city. You know, we embrace them all as a community anyway, but I, the ones that are kind of loud and rowdy are just they just make the event so exciting. CWS officials say they're excited about this year's lineup, especially with LSU's weekend win. Ever since we learned that LSU was one of the team's attendings, I think our adrenaline is that much more pumping. But no matter what team you're rooting for, Morrissey says the bases are loaded for a great 2015 College World Series. When that team is playing here, there's a certain magic in the air, and we're going to find that story with every team. But LSU, we've already seen the script a few years ago. We just hope they stay longer than two games this time. Now LSU and the other seven teams will take uh, to the field here on Friday for batting practice. The public is invited uh, to watch that as well. They're also able to get autographs after practice. Now that uh, batting practice will take place all day long. We have a complete schedule posted on our website. Just head over to KMTV.com. We're live tonight outside TD Ameritrade Park. Josh Egbert, KMTV Action 3 News. All right. Say